Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to check the HRC Sector 5v3 5 inch freestyle frame. In this quick video I'm going to assemble the frame and go over its features and specs and in addition announce the winner of the recent HGRC giveaway. In terms of packaging, inside the box you can find the assembly diagram, the bottom, middle and top carbon fiber plates, four interchangeable carbon fiber arms, two carbon fiber side plates for securing the FPV camera, this part which is going to help to better secure the arms, a 30.5 by 30.5 mm to 20 by 20 mm carbon fiber adapter, all the needed spacers, stand offset screws, and as you can see, everything is well organized. In addition, you are getting some stickers, high quality velcro straps for securing the battery and an action camera, four plastic tubes with rubber covers for protecting the antennas of the radio receiver, an anti skid sticker for the battery, and plenty of 3D printed TPU parts that will enable you to protect the motors, mount the GPS unit, protect the bottom plate, better mount and secure the FPV camera, mount a DJI Air unit, Protect the lens of its camera unit, mount its antennas, secure the wires of the battery connector, mount a TBS Immortal T antenna, and finally mount different types of action cameras. Now I'm going to quickly assemble the frame, and I will see you in a bit in order to check the results. As you can see, now the frame is assembled. In terms of specs, its weight, excluding most of the 3D printed TPU parts, except the button protector, is 124.1 grams. The wheelbase of the frame is about 220 mm and it features a squash X pattern. The thickness of each replaceable carbon fiber arm is 5 mm, its width is 11.3 mm, and on its end you can find an extension that provides some protection for the motors. The distance between the middle plate and the top one is 25.2 mm and both on the center and on the back side of the frame you can find 20 by 20 and 30.5 by 30.5 mm mounting holes so you'll have plenty of space to mount your stack and the video transmitter. In addition, the thickness of the bottom, middle and top plates is 2 mm and on the front side of the frame, using the provided 3D printed TPU adapter, you'll be able to mount a micro-sized FPV camera. As for the other 3D printed TPU parts, first of all, the weight of the motor protectors, which I recommend to use because the battery is going to be mounted on the top side of the frame, is 18.8 grams. And here you can see what it looks like after mounting the protectors on the 5 inch arms. After assembling the rest of the included 3D printed TPU parts, the weight of the frame is 163.7 grams. The weight, including the generic action camera mount, is 172 grams and including the GoPro Hero 7 camera mount, the total weight is 174.9 grams. These elegant action camera mounts are going to be secured to the frame using provided screws and nuts and will enable you to set the action camera angle to either 25, 30, 35 or 40 degrees. This mount is compatible with GoPro Hero 5, 6 and 7 action cameras which are also compatible with the included lens protector and the dimensions of the base of the generic camera mount are 20 by 35 millimeters so it is pretty much compatible with most of the action cameras. So overall, as far as I can tell, the HRC Sector 5 V3, which by the way, just like the V2, in addition to 5 inch, is also available with 6 and 7 inch arms, is a well thought and well designed freestyle frame. I really like the action camera mount, and I also think that it's great that HRC are including all the necessary 3D printed TPU parts. So I'm looking forward to test out this frame, and I'm going to feature it in a build and flight video, which is probably going to be up in the next two weeks or so. Now I'm going to randomly select a lucky subscriber, which is going to win the AJRC cap, the Zeus F722 flight controller, the GPS M80, and the LED board, which all are going to be sent directly to the winner by AJRC. I'm going to randomly select two participants using the YouTube comment picker tool. The first one is going to be the big winner who is going to win the package, and the second one is going to be the runner-up, which is going to win the package in case the first winner is not going to show up until the end of this month. The total amount of unique commenters on the giveaway video is 425. And now let's select the big winner. And the big winner is... Regen V who commented, thanks for the giveaway gal. So you're welcome. And I'm just going to make sure that Regen is subscribed to my channel. And as you can see, Regan V is subscribed to my channel, so congratulations Regan. And in case Regan is not going to show up, 
I'm going to pick the runner-up. And the runner-up is Darius Burakuskas. I hope I pronounced your name right. Sorry if I didn't. And he commented, never tried HRC stuff, so it's an opportunity. Maybe it's an opportunity in case Regan is not going to show up. And I'm just going to make sure that Darius is subscribed to my channel. And as you can see, Darius is subscribed to my channel as well. I'm going to leave my email address in the description box of this video. So please, both of you guys, send me an email and I'm going to take care of the rest. So that's going to be it for this quick video. And of course, if you have any questions about the AGRC Sector 5v3 frame, feel free to ask them in the comments section down below. I would like to thank AGRC for sponsoring this giveaway. And of course, all of you, my subscribers, for watching my videos and for your continued support. I wish you all happy flying and I will see you soon on my next videos. Goodbye.